What is up, Vic gang? Welcome back to another vlog. So, I'm um, just going to get straight into it. Doing my... I guess I could do this like monthly or... I don't know, guys. I'm not rich, okay? So, I could possibly try and push it out to two monthly. Maybe the next Boohoo haul I might switch it up a bit and get a friend to help me out. Oh, my neighbor goes again. I haven't cut my hair, guys, in case you're wondering. It's just been hiding. Yeah, so, um, this is one of the pieces that I kept from the last Boohoo haul. I actually really like it. So, I will be honest, I tried some of these on because I had a marriage seminar conference thing to go to and I needed something to wear. So, I did wear something from my collection. I cheated before you guys got to see it. Okay, so all of the dresses that I have today, I'll be trying them on with Spanx. So the first piece that I have to show today, guys, is this bodysuit. Now, I'm going to put you guys a little bit back because last time it made my clothes look super big and they weren't as big as they looked on camera. So it's this bodysuit. I got this one in a bigger size just because my cousin told me about um, how she had a bodysuit and it came it undid at work. And the other one that I had was kind of tight. So I got a size 24. I think the other one was a 22 last time. I'll be honest, I wasn't able to clip it because my husband helped me the last time. He's not here to help me. So I did go up a size from before, but I, I feel like it just went wider and not longer. But I like the color. I like the contrast with the black pants. Um, it feels comfy, it's not too tight, but then again, it's not clipped down the bottom. The next thing I have is a, it's a plus woman embroidered denim hoodie. Felt like this one was too big. I don't know, you guys can be the judge of that to see whether it looks too, too big or... It is all denim, like there is nothing, it's all denim. I've never actually seen something like this before and it's also got the embroidered woman signature, like the one that I'm wearing right now. So it, it's pretty comfy. The arms feel a little bit short, but I'm not sure if that's just the style. Um, the hoodie's quite big. I like that about it. I'm not sure if, um, actually this might be a good size. For example, guys, see how there's all this material back here? I don't know if that's meant to be the style, but see, like I would have quite liked it if it was tight like this. The front looks nice. But it's just the back, like, like, there's just so much dangling down. If I pulled it down all the way, it could actually go past my butt. Guys, I also got this set. It was a tie-dye um, matching set, which was, I found was a little bit pricey. So I got a 20 in this set, and the material is so different. Um, can you guys see? Oh, that looks so cool on camera. Yeah, so this is a size 20. The material is exactly the same. It's very thin. It's not like, it's not like this. This is very thick. Whereas this is very, very thin material. I mean, not very thin, but it's not what I was expecting. But yeah, I'm interested to know what you guys think about this. So this is the tie dye suit. Um, I feel like I should have gone up a size. Although I may keep these because I'm still trying to lose weight. It may be a perfect fit in a couple of months. Yeah, I just feel like the jumper's a little bit tight around here. Now the next one I have here is my dr the dress that I wore to the marriage seminar. This is it here. <clears throat> it's a midi dress, so it looks like I've got this top and I've tucked it in, but it's all connected. And the material is actually really quite nice. I was picturing like a silk, a synthetic silk kind of material when I was looking at it online, but it's actually quite thick and it actually goes past my, my knees. The midi dress, I love that the wrap kind of um, illusion and there's a little slit down at the bottom here. So the next one guys I have are these, I think they're dad jeans or, yep, blue wash dad jeans. And I got this in a size 24. That's what it looks like. I didn't want to get it too tight, although I'm not sure, like I'll put these on and you guys can let me know whether that's what it's meant to look like or whether it would have looked nicer, a little baggier or a little tighter. 
I like I said before I'm still actually trying to find my sizing in the boohoo collection stuff yeah this is a lot of rip for me uh, I love the fit of them they feel really really comfy I'm just not sure if this is how they're meant to look uh, it's just the belly area I find a little bit exposing because it's actually so high it's a high waist are they sit proof that's the real question so this next piece is this Yes Saint West. You know what I was buying this? I thought this was a Yes Saint Laurent or whatever that whatever that brand is like YSL. That's what I thought I was paying for. So I was like, oh, this looks like a cheap, you know, version. And then it came and it was like Yes Saint West. I'm like, <laughs> but I mean, it's still a nice black like jumper. So I got this one in a size 22. It feels like the kind of material that will get those cotton buds, you know, those little white buds after a while. So this is the jumper. It's actually quite comfy. Nothing too special. I like that the wrists are like quite long. It's actually quite long. That's really nice. Okay guys, we're almost to the end. So this next piece that I have is a, it's a ruffle floral off shoulder midi dress and it is in size 22. The other dress that I got was a size 24. I felt like I could have gone down a little bit. And then this one's a size 22 and I'm like, no, I definitely should have gone up. This feels like a kind of material that you would, that kind of jersey material. That's what the dress feels like. Although you can, you would never be able to tell. It doesn't look like I'll be keeping this one only because I feel like it's super tight. It makes me look like I'm actually pregnant. <laughs> That's not what you want if you're not pregnant. Some of you guys probably didn't know that I had a tattoo. It's very hugging. I probably should have gone a size up, but it's not something that I feel confident to wear. So this is definitely going back. So this next piece, I am definitely returning. Like there is no way I am keeping this. I just don't like it. It just feels so flimsy to me. It's this midi dress, uh, similar to the other one that I had. It looks like you're tucking in a shirt into a high-waisted skirt. It's this white one. It's got uh, these little black dots of love hearts. And I got it in a size 22. This, it's just this for me. Like it, honestly, when it's on, I don't like it at all. Just like the stitching work of it. It does not look, it doesn't look good. No. But I'll try it on for you guys anyways and you guys can tell me. So this one feels a lot more comfortable to wear. White isn't usually a color that um, looks nice on bigger girls because it just accentuates everything. But I feel like this is really complimenting. It is lining my figure, but this puffy thing, it's making my skin really itchy. I like the look, I like the style, but it's just not, like this is really itchy. I'm already feeling irritated. So this last piece, but not least, I got this high-waisted cigarette trouser and I got a size 26. <laughs> I just was not sure. So I went all the way up to the largest that I could find, which was 26. Definitely too big. It doesn't like sit at my waist, but the material is not what I expected for the price. It feels very, I can't even explain it. Like just look at it. It's just like that heavy kind of silky material. I've never seen this tag here before. It says, please do not remove unless you are satisfied with this garment. Returns will not be accepted if this tag has been removed. I've never actually seen this before. I don't know why that's on there. Okay, I'm a little embarrassed to show these, but what the heck? I could pass as Clown Vic in these, honestly. Like, oh, you can't really see it. It looks so much stupider with the naked eye. It just dangles, it's not hugging my tummy. There's a lot of space around here. I really should have gotten a size 24 or 22. I feel like 22 would have been a nice perfect fit because like, I'm not sure if you can see but I've got my bone broth here with me. That's all I had in this haul guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. 
and I hope I'm getting better at these. I mean, it's only my second one. So still, that disclaimer still applies. Please be kind. <laughs> Comment down below what you think I should keep and what you think should go back. Um, I really, really appreciate the feedback I got on the first one. So many of you guys were so kind and generous with your feedback. And a lot of you guys were kindly honest. And I like that as well. Like, it's like this big sister community where you guys can actually be real with me. And if something doesn't look nice, just let me know. <laughs> That's it for now, Vic Gang. Until next time, I will see you guys soon. Hopefully another TTC update coming soon. Bye for now.